This disaster has been devastating for many, many, many people. And what we want everyone to know is that Boulder County is in this recovery process for a long, long time. Boulder County is involved in this process in many different ways. We're a member of the long-term recovery group. We're participating in a countywide stream restoration plan. What are some of the continuing challenges people are having? And we're hearing it's access to their home. The resounding issue right now is people having the creek or rivers rerouted through their lands and their property and wanting to understand what the future is going to be holding for them. It's very hard to tell where it'll end up being because we're just embarking in that process. Debris is a big issue. A lot of, a lot of material has come up on people's private property. It's still in the creek that could propose future hazards. So we're starting to implement a whole de debris pickup program where the county will go around to all the mountain road neighborhoods and pick up household debris and woody debris along the side of the road. This is going to take time. This is a, this is, this is a long term process and it's going to be step by step and there are things we don't know answers to right now. What we're hoping to achieve with the center is a place for people to be able to come in, make contact, and begin to get their questions answered um, and for us to be able to collect information from people so we know what questions we need to be prepared to answer over the long run. It's a one-stop shop where we can have folks come in and begin to identify the questions that they have and start the path to answering all of those questions for them. You can find out about access, uh, what kind of permits are required, and give you advice on how to size a culvert. So we'll have a transportation planner there, as well as folks from public health who can help you give you advice about impacts to your on-site wa wastewater system, as well as your well. We can take a look at aerials on their property. We can look at the floodplain, floodway limitations. We can talk to them about our interim hazard mitigation review process that might be able to assist them looking at risks and hazards surrounding their property. I think the employees here at Land Use and in the county are extremely dedicated to working and trying to find solutions for people, getting questions answered when we don't know the answers yet. Uh, but we don't want people just to give up. We want them to continue to communicate with us what their challenges, what, the, what, their, what they need help in, and, and we will stay in contact and, and work together on this. We know that this disaster has been devastating for many people, many families. Um, the resiliency of our whole community is really heartening. That kind of, of determination and resiliency is what we're trying to do at the county to help people move along.